It's the Animal Claim reporting with Metroland Media Group and in this Your Life video series we are back with the Fridge Whisperer cookbook series author Chef Deb Rankin and the theme of the week is the cucumber. <laughs> uh, delicious food we can use it for different things not just in salad and in this segment we're going to show you how to break down the whole vegetable. Right so uh, I like to use a mandolin but if you do if you know like there's a rite of passage to use one of these. You've got to at least nip off your fingertip once, right? Yeah. And uh, all mandolins come with a guard, of which I do not know where they are. So just okay. be, if you're going to use it and you've lost your guard, just be very careful. I quite like this one because this one you can actually adjust the cutting, the thickness of it. Oh, so what you want to do is if you just want to do like, say, a crudite, um, a cucumber for a vegetable platter, right? So okay. you'd want a thicker slice. Right. So all you do is just hold it down like that and just go like that and you get some nice thick slices. There you go. And the thing like that is you can actually fan it out like that. So, so you know, you're adding a little bit of interest. A little presentation. Yeah. yeah. Cucumber is also very versatile when it comes to doing garnishes. Okay. So that's what you see. It features a lot in sushi platters, okay. right? So what you want to do is just take a little diagonal slice of that mm -hmm. and then just go in with a smaller knife try to use the knife blade that's uh, in keeping with what you're trying to use here so what I want to do first is I just want to take off that edge just to give me a nice flat edge okay, to work so with just, right yeah. so what you want to do is you want to make razor thin slices through the cucumber okay. but not going through to the end and you just go slow. It's going to take a little bit of practice because the thinner you get it, the more success you're going to have with the garnish. Okay. Right? And so then what you do is you open it up like this. And then every other one, you can go like that. Very neat. Right? So it's really pretty. Again, if you're on a sushi platter, even just if it's a crudite platter, that's, that's quite so pretty. Nice. And so simple and how to easy do. Is that? Yeah. So simple to do. Another one you can do is a fan. Okay. So what you do is you're going to cut it off like this mm -hmm. and then like this and then you're going to take off a little bit here like that like just have it okay. and then what you're going to do is again go close to the edge but not, not all, all the way, way through, through. Mm -hmm. and you're just going to do little thin as you can possibly get it okay. and having a good sharp paring knife is essential for this yeah. there's actually special cutting tools that you can use carving tools mm -hmm. and then if you just kind of hold your hand like that you see how it's fanning out yeah so just go like that and then go down like that. And so now you've got your fan. Oh, very neat. Right? Well, thank you very much. <laughs> You're that's welcome. Very, that's neat. Well, stay tuned for more in our Your Life video series. This is Leanne McLean reporting with Metroland Media Group.